If your gas dryer won't stop, here are the six most probable causes. If the dryer's venting or lint filter is clogged with lint or other debris, the airflow within the dryer drum will be restricted, which will substantially increase the drying time. While you should clean the lint filter after every load, you should also clean out the dryer's venting and the lint filter housing at least once a year to ensure good airflow. The blower wheel works with the motor to draw air into the dryer drum and push it out through the vent. If the wheel is obstructed by lint or a small article of clothing or the component is damaged, the time it takes to dry the load could be significantly extended. Check to see if anything is obstructing the blower wheel. If the component appears damaged or stripped, you will need to replace it with a new one. Gas dryers use one or more solenoid coils to open the gas valve and allow gas to flow into the burner assembly. If a solenoid fails, the burner may keep shutting off, which could result in the dryer not stopping. If you observe the igniter glowing and then shutting off without establishing a flame, then one or more of the gas valve coils have probably failed. The high limit thermostat, located on the burner housing, monitors the dryer temperature and will shut the burner off if the dryer overheats. The cycling thermostat, normally located on the blower housing, will cycle the burner on and off to regulate the air temperature. If either of the thermostats fail, the burner may shut off prematurely, greatly extending the drying time. You can use a multimeter to test the thermostats for continuity, a continuous electrical path, to determine if either component has failed or not. While the cycling thermostat should display continuity at room temperature, it should switch off or display no continuity when heated. A moisture sensor monitors the dampness of the clothes and sends a signal to the control board when the clothes are dry. If the sensor is malfunctioning, the dryer may continue to run after the clothes have been dried, although this is not a common problem. On dryers that use a mechanical timer, the motor that runs the timer may become faulty over time and may not allow the drying cycle to advance. This could result in the dryer not stopping. You can replace the timer with a new one to solve the problem. All of the parts shown in this video are available on our website. Be sure to enter the full model number of your appliance in our website search bar to find the specific replacement part that will fix your dryer.